Fans met Pat and Gina Neely back in 2008 after the debut of their Food Network show, Down Home with the Neelys. As cameras rolled, the former high school sweethearts would shower each other with compliments and pepper audiences with cooking tips. Can you give me one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar? Surely. She's a sweetheart. But as affectionate as they appeared, there was turmoil simmering behind the scenes. The pair dropped a bombshell when they called it quits in 2014 and filed for divorce after 19 years of marriage. So what was really going on? Here's the untold truth of the Neelys. Fifth time's a charm. Two years after news of their divorce hit headlines, Gina told Own the couple endured 12 failed attempts at couples therapy, admitting, I tried to leave five times and I just didn't have the strength, but the fifth time I held on to that. It became necessary for me to find my path. But by age 46, Gina was ready to change her life. And I knew I wasn't happy. And I said, I'm definitely not gonna take 50 and not be happy. Not only did she drop Pat, but after leaving their marriage behind, she shed 34 pounds and completely transformed her look. Pre-show jitters. In front of cameras, the Neelys appeared to have a strong and healthy relationship. But as time went on, fans found out it was all a facade. Gina revealed to people that she never even wanted to be a part of the show, saying, I would cocoon myself. I never wanted to be a TV chef. She also claimed she had plans to divorce Pat right before the show got picked up, but she wasn't going to turn her back on the commitment she had made to the network, despite her children begging her to quit the series. Scrape it around. My mama raised me right. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to ever waste chocolate. It's a girl's best friend. Gina also told people she had grown up in a broken home, and she didn't want to raise her daughters the same way. Going dark. Despite being married for almost two decades and raising two children together, the former couple has since cut ties with each other completely. After their divorce was finalized, Gina recalled to People in 2018, I remember leaving with my purse and my duffel bag, and I was out of there. I haven't spoken to Pat in four years. I don't wish him any harm, but he's never reached out to me. Since their daughters were already older in age, she didn't feel the need to co-parent with her former spouse. Gina told People, They're older, and they have their own lives. And I try to convince them to establish their own traditions. Don't rely on mom and dad so much, because we may not always be here. Secret arrangements. As if their divorce announcement wasn't shocking enough, fans were completely floored when Gina revealed that she and Pat had separated two years prior to calling it quits. She told Wendy Williams in 2014. You moved out like two years ago? Yep. Because we were trying to work on it and just trying to do some things differently, but, you know, it just ended up that way. Unsurprisingly, many of their fans felt conned by the former couple's on-screen displays of affection. Was it all fake? When Pat and Gina Neely's marriage came crashing down, no one felt more duped than their loyal fans. According to Gina's claims of trouble in paradise, the splitting up spouses were still on a loved up press tour. When Pat told Forbes in 2012, Gina gave me something I truly needed, balance. You both bring stuff to the table. Neither is more blessed or greater than the other. And Gina doubled down saying, when you say I do, you're saying I'll work. You have to work at your marriage every day. If you don't wanna work every day, you need to abstain. Fans weren't feeling the love when TMZ reported that Pat and Gina were pretending their marriage was fine, when they really hated each other for years. But hey, that's showbiz. Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.